Holy shit, it's even longer. Fancy. Check it out. Uh. All right, so it's about eleven o'clock right now. It's pretty awesome. Or I'm gonna try to go to Christ the Redeemer. I gotta figure out how to do it. All right, so there's my destination up ahead. Um, I'm in an Uber right now. He doesn't understand English. I don't speak Portuguese. <laughs> so it's like, it's just, I'm just going with it. All right, that wasn't that bad. So for $26, you get your ticket to board the bus. I'm such a tourist on my phone. I'll probably come back and check this place out, but I'll be boarding in about 20 minutes. I really think the reason why Brazilians have such big booties is you gotta walk up and down these hills. Oh, I went to the wrong place. Gotta go back up the hill, into the store, to the left. train but I bought a ticket to the shuttles instead so I missed out on the train ride it's all right though I'm here in another country being a tourist by myself Like you can also walk up without getting mugged. Oh, are you sure? I didn't get mugged yesterday. Yes, and you can go to the to the first little hill. All right, I made it to the statue. Uh, my hair is not making it this way, but this is pretty amazing. So I took 
took all my pictures, I got my footage. It's only about 1.30. Kinda wanna hang around for a bit just to kinda take it all in. Not worry about the camera, and not worry about taking pictures and videos, so I'm gonna do that. Sometimes you just have to put away the devices and enjoy. So we've been used for the road? Nah. This was the shuttle system that I used. I'm kind of disappointed that it wasn't a red train. But again, I didn't read any instructions. I don't know Portuguese. And I didn't ask anyone for help. I just saw something that says English by here. 220 steps that way to get to the Redeemer. Apparently that bee likes it as much as I do. I was sitting right over there at that corner and then a bee came so I kind of came inside. I am so glad to be in my room. Just got back from Christ the Redeemer or uh, Cristo Redentor here in Brazil. Um, one of my biggest concerns was going there is that I would not have internet connection on my phone and then contacting an Uber would have been an issue, which it was. Um, so I ended up waiting about 30 minutes for an Uber ride. The internet kept kind of disconnecting us. I was actually even standing in the wrong spot where cars are not allowed to go. Um, that's why I didn't see my first Uber or who knows what happened there. But somehow we ended up so I finally got into an Uber and I am headed back here to the hotel and somehow we are driving like through the favelas, what seems like it, um, and kind of like all of these windy roads, kind of like Mulholland Drive or driving up to Mendocino or it's just the, yeah, I was not feeling the car ride, but I'm glad that I am back here, yeah.